So the battery rating is fixed on my iPhone. In today's video, I'm going to share how I fixed battery rating on my iPhone. I'm going to share solutions for you guys. So without any further delay, let's get jump into this video. If you are new on this channel, make sure to subscribe. Also drop the comment if you're having any sort of problem. Anyways, first thing first, I want to show you that if the battery is draining on my iPhone or not. And now as you can see, it's a pretty much straight line. And here is a small drop where I actually start using my phone over here. As you can see, it's a pretty much a straight line, which means there is no battery draining happening, which is really, really nice. Now, how you can fix this is very simple. There are few settings that you need to follow. And after this, you will be able to fix the battery draining on your iPhone running any iOS version. For now, this device is running iOS 18.2.1. Let me show you that too. If I go over here, something here, as you can see, I'm running 18.2.1. But I'm gonna share how you can fix this battery rating just like I did and how you can improve the overall battery life of your iPhone. So let's begin this video. So first of all, let's go to some of the settings that you need to turn off. So go to the privacy and security over here. After that, go to the tracking over here. Now turn the tracking off for every other application just like this, the way I did. Now go back from here, go to the location services. Over here, you can choose while using option. For example, if I go over here or maybe go to some other app, there is another option known as always. Most people are on always option. And when you are on always option, no matter you are using your device or not, it is draining the battery in the background because it is using your location. So what you can use is while using the app or never, this can help a lot to fix the battery draining. Now from here, go to system services, go all the way down under product management. There is three things available. Now, these three things are also running in the background. So, turn them off just like I did. Now, go back from here. Go back from here into privacy and security. Go all the way down into the analytics and improvements. Now, go over here. Turn this off. As you can see, every other setting is turned off. Just for example, if you turn this on, what will happen? In the background, it will be sharing analytics with Apple and that will be consuming a lot of battery life in the background. So just turn them off. You don't need to turn these things off. Now go back from here. Go to Apple Advertising. Turn this off to go back from here. Go to Journaling Suggestions over here. As you can see, they are off. You don't need them to turn them on if you don't use a journaling app. So it is also better to just turn them off. Now go back from here, go back from here, go to journal and from here go to background app refresh. Now if there is any app that you don't want to use in the background, just turn that off. For example, over here, this is a news app. I really don't want this news app to be running in the background. There is no sense of that. So I just turn that off. So when there are less apps running in the background, there will be a less battery consumption, will, will, which will also fix battery rating for your iPhone. So you can also do this. Now, after turning these settings off, you have pretty much done a really good thing. And in a couple of days, you will see a much better battery life. Now, what you can also do is you can follow a 2080 rule in which you never let your device go beyond 20%. So when you are, are around 20%, just put it on charging and charge it until 80%. This is the best way to save the battery health of your iPhone and it can also fix battery draining on your iPhone and this way you will be able to improve the battery life. Also what you can do is use MFI data cables and charger. These are like specially made for the iPhone. They are certified by the Apple. If you can't afford to go for the original Apple accessories, you can go for the third party but buy a third party that are approved by Apple. This way they, these things will not hurt the battery health of your iPhone and you will be able to improve the battery life and you will be able to improve the overall uh, battery draining and the performance of your device. These things, uh, these are some of the things that I applied on this device and after that I just show you that I am getting a really good battery life and there is no battery draining at all. You can also apply this on your device. Well, 
this is all from this video i hope you like this video if you did give this video a big thumbs up do like i share this channel um make sure to subscribe and if you're facing any sort of problem other than this let me know in the comment section below and i will catch you guys in the next one peace out